this keyboard isn't going to slide around your desk unless maybe there's an earthquake. What really sets this keyboard apart, though, is the Hall Effect Gatrion 2.0 magnetic switches. That mouthful means that these switches allow for a level of customization that goes far beyond your typical keyboard. You can adjust the actuation point of every single key separately, meaning you can set some keys to register with a lighter press and other keys to register only with a heavy press. For example, in gaming, you could set a key to crouch with a light touch and then go prone with a full press. Okay, customization brings me to the software. Unlike many keyboards that require clunky software, the Keychron Q1HE uses a web-based configuration tool. It's a little confusing the first time you use it, but it's easy to use and has endless customization options. You can create multiple profiles for different tasks, whether you're typing, gaming, or editing videos. I found the process of configuring the keyboard mostly simple and intuitive, and it's a big plus for anyone who likes to tweak their setup. The Keychron Q1HE supports multiple connection types, including wired, Bluetooth, and a USB dongle for fast connectivity if you do not have a computer with the latest Bluetooth. This means you can easily switch it between different devices using different connections, and it's actually switchable between a Windows and a Mac layout of the keyboard, so you can use it for either setting. Right now it has the Mac keys on it, but I could easily swap out these keys for the traditional Windows keyboard. In everyday use, this keyboard has been fantastic for gaming and productivity. It's a keyboard built to perform in high demanding environments, 